you know, I put a lot of blame on my mother. And therefore, as I got older, I put a lot of blame on my ex-girlfriends, my ex-wife, all ex-women, right? The exes, ex-women, women. I gave my dad all the credit in the world. Never thought about, you know, the good things that my mother did for me. After my parents got divorced, I blamed my mother. My mother was beat, beat up, raped, all of that. She told me those things. But I blame my mother for every little thing that happened to me later on in life. And I was dead wrong, right? Only reason why I was able to open up and connect to my mother um, years after she had passed was through therapy, sitting down talking one-on-one. -on -one. Hey, Leon, let's talk about your mother. And I was like, nah, we ain't gonna do that. You talking about my father? My father was cool. My father was there for me. It's my dude. I love my dad. Boom, boom, boom. Well, no, Leon, you know, just for a moment, give me a chance. Let's talk about your mom. Tell me something good about your mom. And boom. I'm like, damn, sitting in therapy, crying like a mother for crying because I didn't get my mother credit. And then I started thinking, damn, I didn't get my ex-girlfriend credit. I didn't get my ex-wife credit. Damn, therapy blew me away. My mother's the reason why I learned how to swim. And in joining the Navy, you have to learn, you have to know how to swim. I already knew how to swim because of my mother. My mother was the reason why I started playing football. My mother was the reason why I became a Cub Scout. My mother was the reason why I started taking up karate. Yeah, my mother. My mother was the reason why I learned how to bob for apples. My mother gave us the Halloween parties, the, 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 the birthday parties. My mother was part of the black parties. Yup. And so in therapy, I started like feeling good and better and better and better. Without therapy, I'll still be mad at my mother to this day at 57 years old. Without therapy, I'll still be mad at my ex-girlfriend at 57 years old. Without therapy, I'll still be mad at my ex-wife at 57 years old. I was always pushing the blame on the women in my life. And a lot of times, the women were the reason why I became stronger. The reason why I was able to be successful in the military. Right? Men too, don't get me wrong, my dad was a hell of a man. He was a hell of a provider. He was one hell of a protector. But until I went through therapy, I was mad at my mother. I was mad at my grandmother. I was mad at my sister, my cousins. I have some strong women in my family. My sister, my cousins, my grandmother, my mother. You know, some strong women. And I was like, damn, I'm strong just like them. Not just like, like my dad, but I'm strong like these women in my family. So I had to give women the credit uh, for me being here. I give women the credit for making these videos about narcissism, my ex. You know, she's like, Leon, you started talking about it. And I was like, boom, I give women. Uh, credit for making me stronger and being able to face who I was. Y'all have a great day.